In our FOX 35 mission control, pictures from the newly developed James Webb Telescope are changing what scientists know about the cosmos. Yeah, researchers say they are still digging for more information. FOX 35's Matt Napolitano shares the latest. And lift off. You've seen it on the news, on social media, stellar photos from NASA's James Webb Telescope, pictures that after decades of effort are changing what scientists know about the galactic landscape. We peeked through that cloud, those clouds of dust and gas um, that we've never been able to see through before, and we're seeing star formations and the galaxies from 13 billion years ago that, again, we've just never seen before. Camille Calabeo, better known as the galactic gal to her hundreds of thousands of followers on social media, is among the those enchanted by the web photos from a new angle of the planet Jupiter to wonders like the Carina Nebula. But more data remains to be revealed by NASA, including new details about the TRAPPIST-1 system. We think that there are anywhere between three to seven habitable worlds around this star. Um, and so they're, they're right there in the Goldilocks zone. They could have life or they could have had life in the past or might be able to have life in the future. While there is the possibility of life, Calabeo makes clear that's not what the web photos are intended for. JWST is not looking for life itself. It's looking specifically in the atmospheres of exoplanets. So like, you know, of course that leads to, could we find life? Could we, you know, we, we found water in the atmosphere of an exoplanet for the first time ever and that hints at the, you know, the potential for life to exist there. What's next for space exploration? The launch of NASA's Artemis program, seeking to establish a sustainable presence on the moon to prepare for missions to Mars. In New York, Matt Napolitano, Fox News.